It's it's inside. Review from Mark. Tetris. More precisely, Brick Game. The most popular handheld among the Slavs. The thing that went from being just a popular toy to a nostalgic one. And yet it hasn't disappeared from the shelves for a second. No Game Boy, PSP and definitely no handheld Sega. The Slavs had neither these things nor the money for them. Only Tetris. Uh, brick game. Slavs play with bricks. And 20 years later the Nintendo Switch, on which Slavs play Tetris. Uh, brick game. Slavs love bricks. Bricks, rise to nails and car by are the best friends of a Slavic child. The game itself has survived the difficult journey from Alexei Pajitnov's huge Soviet computer to a handheld game on the Game Boy. While this time the Slavs themselves did not see this game, and only then, when such handhelds became obsolete and cost little more than a handful of pedigree, Chinese communist comrades copied the game and brought it back to its historical homeland in the form of this guy. Check it out! It was supposed to be a copy of Game Boy! Not even the Slavs have a clue about that! See? Here's the game! Here's the boy. Hey boy. It just so happens that this stuff is still on sale everywhere. And it is so completely coincidentally happens that I also have one. And now we're going to look at it and play it. Pour some tea and mayonnaise and let's begin. Okay, dear friends, here's our package. Today we have in our hands According to the seller, a new arrival burning childhood Tetris brick play top education play gamepad. And the game store well fanatic provided it to us. Of course they did, I paid for it. First the package, the bag, it's sealed, it was. And inside here is a foamy uh, foam, a very useful thing to, to use it later. As you've all guessed by now, I think this is Tetris. Let's look at the box, let's examine it. Here we see yellow, yellow Tetris. Here it says Upia, 9999 games in one, very profitable, you don't have to buy any more games ever. There is a funny face here, which smiles at us and sort of tells that we are going to have fun playing. How nice it was as a child, what an interesting Tetris. I really hope it's the same game, it used to cost $5. In Russian tech stores, they still exist. Question mark. It's on sale there for 10 bucks. You can see them at the cash register. They are lying separately from the boxes on the floor. Broken. And the price tag. $10. What do we see on this side? QR code. You can try to uh, scan it. The box is nice. It is cardboard and you can put it on a shelf. And uh, be happy. Assassin's Creed, Tetris and some other unknown games uh, which I don't know. Of course I know about them. It's a gamer channel, first of all. You know what these games are. Why do you have to discuss them all the time? And there is a function here. It also states that you, that children should not eat it, this console. Although it is digestible. But you can choke on it. I asked the guys for a black Tetris. They said they would send it to me. Ah, black. That's a nice bag. It fits the size. Very functional, if you want to. This bag can be put on. Here we see a battery compartment, opening function, and consequently the closing function. Anyway, let's leave it like that for now, because we have to put the batteries in anyway. A hole for the speaker, buttons just like before, and for some reason when I move one button the other moves. Ok, now they've all started to move, it's already written super here. We have the film on the screen here. It's, it's inside. Ok, let the screen be more protected. The case of course is a lightweight. Wait, the battery holes, they, you, could, you can see them through the 
It's for the... You look at this, huh? Um, anyway, there's almost no backlash. Well, al almost no backlash. It's a little bloated, of course. There are bubbles all over the body. Did they boil it? Ah, blech! Calls from the buttons! Do you realize that it's pressed from the batteries? Uh, this is the, the battery compartment! Review from Mark! There are holes from buttons! You look, there are holes from buttons! Here! Buttons! Buttons! And there! How, how could they? Do I have to play like this? Look, it's bloating! Bloating! Tetris! Bloating! Blech! I thought the point of the game was that the cubes were jumping and it's bloating! Why does it say Uria? Upi Upia? Here it says Super. What it, What? What is that? Is that Mickey Mouse? Is that a Chinese code? Why? Why is he dancing? Why is he fat? You see? Brick game. Brick game, indeed. But I thought the bricks were falling down here, not out of me. I asked for a black Tetris, and they sent me shit. Hello? Uh, hello? Chinese, you sent me a bad Tetris. How could you put a protective film under the case? It's bubbling, bubbling, well, look at that, it's, it's bubbling. In fact, the entire body is bubbling. <laughs> okay. Let's take a look at its specifications. Its width is, uh, it's like this. The length is, uh, it's enough. You put this and you draw a circle like this. Well, there's something losing it. The straightness of it, uh, good. It weighs 103 grams. Let's run through the menu. The right button changes the left function. And the left button changes the right function. Let's turn on the sound and hear the very same Kalinka Malinka. Unfortunately, there is no Kalinka Malinka. I thought it was going to explode. Who is this? Who? who? What is it doing here? So I tell them, Black Tetris. Black Tetris. It also stinks of something. I think there is a reaction going on. If you like this device, this exciting... Exi excite... Ex Exile to Siberia should be for this! To the mines! Oh. The batteries are out. Here, Mario, do you remember how you played Tetris as a kid? Why? Why? You shouldn't do that. What's that? That's Tetris. There should be four cubes. Can't you count to four? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ch ch what is this child of Saturn? It also says Super Mouse. It's not just this horse running. This horse is a Super Mouse. That's what a Super Mouse looks like. So Superman has to be a fat ballerina, right? Do you know how to use a level? You put it like this, and if you see a ball, right there, between the stripes, then you are not pregnant. Oh, hey, Carl. Hello, Gennady. How are you doing? Uh, uh, shit, there, you see? How do you like this game? DiCaprio! You, in general, think. Is that a Chinese mascot? Oh, you mean somebody drew that? Give this one to a child. He'll say, what am I, adopted? Why? I think it's starting to burn. Okay, it's time to evacuate. Yeah, you can't beat the love of gaming any harder. But anyway, it's a great good memory of a large number of people. And it doesn't look much worse than the Tiger Games games. Oh gosh, stop, shut up, gosh! So, no matter how weird you look, Chinese Game Boy with bricks. Thank you for the warm, weird memories, which still makes me warm and cringe at the same time. And that's all for today. My name is Mark, subscribe, comment, like and see you next time, blood!